What's happening guys and welcome back to Celebrity Overdose. There's been a long-standing controversy where people assume that Stormy is not Travis's daughter and it has once again made the news. In this video, we're taking a look at Travis Scott speaking on Stormy not being his real kid. But before we get rolling, do be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our future videos going forward. Number 7. Beginning of the Controversy The Kardashian and Jenner family has been involved in some of the craziest controversies and rumors known to mankind, but one among them never ceases to exist online. We are of course talking about the fact that some people are of the opinion that Travis Scott is not the real father of Stormy. There's no real reason for people to be thinking this, and it all stemmed from numerous allegations that Kylie Jenner had an affair with someone prior to her daughter being born. Whether or not it's true, it's created a ton of headlines for the family, and in that family, no news is bad news. While it may not have had an effect on the Jenner family, it did create an uncomfortable situation for those around them. And one of those people was Kylie's bodyguard, who some people alleged was the father of the baby. Number 6. Statement from Bodyguard Soon after people started hearing that Stormy was not Travis's baby, they started to look at the people around Kylie, and one man that was constantly around her was her bodyguard Tim Chung. When baby pictures of Stormy first started circulating online, people on social media began to put them against pictures of Tim. As you can imagine, this would have created a very awkward situation between him and his employer Kylie. People online can be relentless when they become sure of something and things got so bad that Tim at one point had to address all the controversy around him. He put out a statement on Instagram that said that while he never gets involved in any rumors and gossip that takes place online, out of respect for Kylie and Travis, he clarified that any and all involvement he had had with Kylie was strictly professional. In any normal world, this would have been the end of things but people still continue to badger him for a while. Finally, after a long time, the fans found a new target that they assumed was Stormy's real father, which was Drake. Who would have expected that twist in this story, right? Number 5. Moving on to Drake Drake is one of the most famous musicians in the world, and as such, he's always in the news when it comes to his relationships. Throughout his career, he's had several relationships, but one that seemed to have made the greatest number of headlines was the one he supposedly had with Kylie Jenner. You see, back before these rumors, Drake was a good friend of the entire Kardashian-Jenner family, and as such, he had been around Kylie a few times. Seeing as the two of them have an 11-year age gap, when he was initially around her, she was still just a teenager. As such, there were no rumors of the two of them getting together, but when she grew up, the chatter online became incessant. The two of them were even rumored to be in a relationship with one another after Kylie had broken things off with Travis for a while, but in the end, there's a good reason for all those rumors to exist, and it's based on something that came directly from Drake himself. I'm really busy, I gotta go. Hey, I'm really busy, can I call you back? Number 4. Referencing Kylie in a song while the rumors surrounding Drake and Kylie were non-stop, they became even more numerous after Drake shared a snippet of a song he had been working on. He shared that snippet on his social media, and in that song, he could be heard referring to Kylie as a side piece. As you can imagine, after this, people were 100% sure that something had happened between her and Drake. One other thing that made people sure about this was the fact that the song was never released to the public and to this day remains an unreleased piece of music. So does this mean that the Kardashian-Jenner clan has something to do with this not being released? Who knows, because at this point, Drake hasn't specifically told the public why the song wasn't released. Number 3. Same story with second child After Kylie gave birth to Stormy, she went ahead and enjoyed her life with the baby for a few years but as you might be aware, she recently gave birth to a new baby boy. As you can imagine, all the online chatter that had slightly simmered down suddenly reignited and was in full force after this birth. People were once again claiming that this new baby was not Travis's son either. Last time Kylie had a baby, she shared a lot of pictures of her online, and that was one of the ways that people compared her facial features to the people around Kylie, 
but this time, Kylie was one step ahead. After the birth, she didn't share any photos of the baby, and immediately after he was born, she simply shared the news by posting a picture of his hand. This also ended up creating a controversy because people were of the opinion that since she hadn't shared the face of the baby, he must not have any features resembling that of Travis. One of the reasons why people think that this child was the result of an affair was that the timing supposedly coincides with when she had an affair with Drake last year. This is all just online chatter and there's no real proof to this, but recently, someone with knowledge of the Kardashians has spoken out about this. What? Number 2. Tokyo Tony's Revelations The Kardashian-Jenner family has tons of things going on in their life at any given moment, and one of the latest headline-making news has been the live stream done by Tokyo Tony. If you aren't aware of who that is, she's the mother of Black China, who's the mother of Rob Kardashian's daughter Dream. She was talking about a number of things in her live stream, and at one point, the conversation moved towards Kylie Jenner. She said that while she might seem like a sweet and innocent soul on the outside, that's not who she truly is. She said that Kylie was the most vicious among them all. That's a big allegation to put against Kylie Jenner, but there must have been a reason for her to be saying all that. There have been numerous controversies surrounding Black China as well, so there's no telling who's in the right in the situation. But after she had spoken about Kylie's character, she moved on to the most shocking news that we've heard. Number 1. Birth Certificate Controversy During the live stream that Tokyo Tony did, she said that the public hadn't been shown a birth certificate for Stormy and that there was a reason for that. Interestingly enough, a few days after Kylie's son's birth, his birth certificate was leaked online, so there remains no confusion about his lineage. Tokyo Tony pointed out the fact that even though so many years had passed since Stormy's birth, her birth certificate still hadn't been revealed. This struck a chord with a lot of people and they resonated with this sort of thinking. In the end, no matter what people may say online, there still isn't any concrete proof saying that Stormy isn't in fact Travis's daughter. So these were some of the things that have been said about Stormy and Travis's relationship. Since it's been going on for so long without an end in sight, it doesn't seem like anything can put a stop to this controversy. This brings us to the end of our video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit that bell so you don't miss out on future videos and updates. If you enjoy the content, then do let us know by smashing that like button. And until next time, take care and goodbye.